Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to explain to you guys what to do if you do not have any system restore points on your computer, but maybe you would have otherwise done a system restore. So just for example here, if we were to go ahead and open up system restore here, so create a restore point, and just open that up, and then you were to see that it's turned off. So if you don't have any restore points saved, it's just not going to work, so there's no point in trying to figure out how to get restore points if there are none. But something you can try here, so once you would boot into safe mode or into advanced recovery, try and remember what you did that created the situation in which you are having issues with your computer. So was there a problematic program or application you installed? Was there a faulty Windows update that perhaps you downloaded? Did you just change uh, physical hardware in your machine? Just consider those options as to what you've recently done, or maybe you've opened something or you've done some setting change just think about what you did and then if you can find out how it was done you should be able to figure out how to undo it so a Windows update you can just go back in and actually uninstall updates and I have tutorials on my channel on how to do that you can google that as well and you can google how to uninstall programs and then if you had a specific game that you perhaps installed consider uninstalling it or there were some settings that you tweaked in your Windows settings go ahead and just undo those find the tutorial that you followed to do it in the first place and then just do it in the reverse steps basically so pretty straightforward process guys just going to require a little bit of work on your end so pretty straightforward guys make sure to always create system restore points for the future and that should hopefully be about it so as always thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial do hope i was able to help you out and i do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial goodbye